often than not, they miss and land less than 25% of their significant strike attempts. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here today. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. for this week. All right, here he is, the founding father of modern MMA, Bruce Lee, ready to go for round one. The speed and the angles, just absurd, and a hard guy to simulate in training. You think you got a beat on him, and then you end up twitching on the canvas. So we'll see how the opponent chooses to defend Bruce Lee here in the early go. Nice liver shot lands. Fighter lands a kick to the head now. Lee's hook shot is blocked. Saw that coming from a mile away. Oh, and another leg kick lands flush, and now you're starting to see visible damage on that lead leg of his opponent. Visible damage, and you see him starting to make mistakes now in his defenses because his leg is so beat up. It's red, it's all beat up, he's limping, he's turning away. There are so many things that he is doing wrong now because of the leg damage he has taken. Oh, how good is this? One minute into the fight, and we got a full-on brawl. These guys said that they were going to point to the center of the octagon, and they were going to fight. Did I believe them? No. So right now, I am so wrong. They are doing exactly what they said. Yeah, shades of Max Holloway against Ricardo Lamas back in the day. You buy the ticket to see fights like this. What a fight. Well, missed on that one. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Nice front kick there. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Oh, that one landed, yep. Back and forth we go. Just out of range with that strike. Oh, right hook attempt, no good. Oh, he lands another hook there. He's already landed several in the round. That one might have been the cleanest of the bunch. He turned his chin, made his chin touch his shoulder with that beautiful right. hook. He really got all of himself into that hook. Pivoted off the right hand, big left hook lands. What a great punch. Well, he was setting up the oh, a huge shot, finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow up attempt. The kill shot was what they call it to go and end the fight. Under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here. Nice body shot. Lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing. Oh, oh man, DC, he would appear to be in real trouble. Oh, huge left. They continue to exchange. 
Those are the body kicks that'll crumble you. punch so he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here these are going to take their toll as this fight goes on one minute. under a minute now to go in this one Nice knee to the body, very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Lands a shot to the leg. Oh, now going to the body with that hook. Nicely done there by Lee. Out of range with that kick attempt. the sidekick now. Ten seconds to go in the round. He's got that single power right. time locked in. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, we now take a look back at some of the highlights from that last round, DC. A lot for the replay guys to choose from. I mean, these guys are going to be very busy trying to find what replay to show you guys. Lands on both sides of the octagon. Both guys fought great. What a phenomenal round. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two is on the way. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top. Oh, is that a huge strike right there? I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Punch to the body. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Not there. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Oh! Nice, good strikes. Keep going forward. This is big. That's big. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the bargain. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Kobe Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. a massive kick here. Now a knee. Checks the leg kick. Oh, the kick landed. Oh, he continues to attack the body yet again here, just as he did in the previous round. Oh, side kick. Well done. Is crazy. What a beautiful jab landing there. Well, from a striking standpoint, he has put it all together tonight. He has landed a ton of significant strikes and pretty easy fight, I would think, for the judges to score. It's a pretty easy fight to score. Tonight was a night where everything went right, and that doesn't happen very often. Get those combinations going. Move 
Two minutes now to go round two. Oh, oh he's in real trouble now. Oh, big left hook there. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that. Oh! Lee's strike attempt there is blocked. Real quick leg kick. Taking a lot of body shots as well. Just misses with the left hand. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's, a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Forty-five seconds remain in the round. Seconds to go in round two. Lee gets caught with that punch. Back and forth we go. And that one certainly found the target. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. No! Right hand over the top. High-level striking action in that last round. Daniel, take us through it, if you will. Tit for tat. Who has the best chin? It seemed as though they were looking for that answer. Both guys took risk. What a fantastic round. Ready. Ready. Third, Third round, round underway. All right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high level expression. Oh, a nice little white hook there. Well, you gotta think at some point these hooks are gonna start to take their toll. Another one landed there flush by Lee. Oh, big punch lands. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. Out of range with that one. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Oh, nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this matchup. What a nasty kick. That was thrown with ill intent. with that jab attempt there. Pretty good jab there by Lee. All right, he'll engage in a single follow tie. Just over three minutes to go. Just out of range with the big right hand. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Oh, nice. Now. 
And we have passed the midpoint of the fight. Leg kick. Back to the overhand now. That one's good. There it is, another strike to the body. That has been a big storyline in this fight. We'll keep an eye on it as the bout continues. You know, we'll keep an eye on it. But the person that should be addressing it is his opponent. His opponent isn't doing anything to, to deter him from doing this constantly. He has got to change something if he wants to fight this fight and win this fight. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, nice. Nice. Lee's kick is blocked. Under 90 seconds to go. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Straight right, he misses. Nice push kick there to the body. Now they separate. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Big inside kick. Both fighters throwing heat now. Oh, he goes to the counter right just out of range. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. 15 seconds. Made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Closing the distance here. Oh, he separates from the clinch. Oh. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. Right now we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. You ready to fight? Ready. Go we have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five, five so another round is now underway. Pretty good action over the previous 10 minutes. Your thoughts on what we might see here? Both huge strike lands there, and somehow his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Oh! Man, he's got good hands. Beautiful strike there. Trading huge shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Get that button. Ball left hook to the head. It's blocked. Oh, good work with the jab there. Keep now. Fighter lands a left punch now. Goes upstairs with the kick. His cardio is great right now. Oh, he's hurt. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Man, his head's chin been tested early. Oh, lands an elbow. Didn't open him up, but very well could have. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar tie. 
And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his leg well yet again. Under three minutes to go in round four. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Lee going for the body, missed with that kick. The big left hook coming, it's blocked. Lands a nice jab there. Just misses with the kick. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one dimensional, not head hunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now and it's starting to show itself. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Nice straight there by Lee. Ooh! Circling towards the left now. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Nice leg kick. Good series of kicks by him there, DC. He certainly has that part of his game going tonight. He's a fantastic kickboxer, but tonight is the kicks that lead the dance. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Caught the kick. Now some separation. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. There's his jab. All right, well, he made no bones about his game plan. He was going to attack the body, and he does so effectively yet again there. Well, how about the discipline? How about the discipline to stay the course, to not rush, to not go head hunting, knowing that down the line, all these body shots will pay off for him. And now you can see it starting to happen. Final seconds of the round. Potentially five to go. All right, great round, great round, bud. Relax, take a deep breath and listen. You are out striking this guy. He's trying to make this an ugly fight, though. Don't get suckered in. All right, let us now check out some of the action, DC, and what a display of body striking there in that previous round. I mean, the last time I saw this done at this level was Valentina Shevchenko and Jessica I. Body kick, body kick, body kick. Eventually look for him to go over the top to try to end the fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. We have arrived at this fifth and final round. All right, so here we go with our next round. DC, you are known for having one of the higher fight IQs in the game, and I would put him on that list after what we saw in terms of the body work there in the previous round. He did a fantastic job of mixing up his target, not head hunting, going to the body, making that investment into forcing a mistake later that will allow him to chase his finish. Just out of range with that left hook. Well, the most significant stat in this fight has been body strikes. And at times in the past, maybe you could say he's been a headhunter. But tonight, he has worked the body to great effect. And those are really starting to take their toll.
Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Hands high, hands high. Beautiful straight punch there by Lee. Well, I'm no analyst, but this fighter is completely out of gas, hasn't managed his tank well at all, and to compound matters, he's getting cooked on the scorecards. Too. I mean, he is getting outclassed right now. He's tired, he's beaten, his mind is starting to go too. This is not a good predicament for this fighter. Lands a nasty body kick. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him. There. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's... Oh, picture perfect shot there. You can see it. One more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. What a fun fight between two guys that only focus on offense. If you're gonna go out, go out on your shield. If you're going out, go out on your shield. Don't just walk backwards. Go forward. Make him fight you. Oh, inside kick. You rip the body there. Oh, pretty good technique as he lands the sidekick, DC. Real nice technique to land that sidekick. He did a great job of getting that leg up and then right to the target. Leg kick. Two minutes now to go in this one. And just a big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that fit. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, just misses. Keep your hands up, use your footwork back. It's okay, use your footwork. Unable to connect with a right hook. Oh, big head kick. Whiffs on that offering. All right, let's go. Let's get those hands going now. Side kick is true. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Back and forth we go. One more kick down. One minute to go in the fight. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Oh, I think he's still compromised. We'll see if he can recover here. He's in a world of trouble. Oh, beautifully placed shot to the leg. Oh, nice knees to the body. Take down defenses there. And look at the post on the opposite side to give himself the correct space to land these beautiful knees. Well, this fight's been pretty crazy thus far. Both guys doling out a lot of damage, and neither seems too bothered by it, but clearly both parties are hurt. Both guys are hurt. Both guys are fighting beautifully. Both are showing a lot of heart right now in this fight. They're both doing amazing jobs. Let's see who gets the job done at the end of the game. Oh, and there's the final oh. horn. We go to the scorecards. One of the greatest fights that we have seen all year. All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. Official decision now in, the buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 49-46. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. 
This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since coming to the UFC, and more often than not, he has had it.